Hello and welcome back to the Apollo Gaia presentation series on YouTube. And today we are going to look at the boundary conditions of runaway in the global climate system. We use the parable of the runaway car as an introduction. This turns to the more uh, scientific base of which the parable was, if you like, metaphor. The slide I'm using shows a series of uh, temperatures going up to new equilibrium positions. And you remember we talked about the cheetah, the, the climate cheetah in a previous video. Now, all the lower lines here, if you like, are computer models of sensitivity, how much the Earth system amplifies human change. The red line represents the way the Earth system as a whole physically responds to change in carbon dioxide. Now, we've noted that current change is about 300 times faster and more intensive than any change in the historical records on which all this study has been based. And under those conditions, we push the sensitivity even higher than it was in the historical period. And that enables us to see that we can approach a tipping point, a runaway tipping point or critical threshold, beyond which, instead of reaching a new equilibrium, temperature goes on going up, and the faster it goes up, the faster it goes up. And we have a series of possibilities of moving the climate into runaway behavior. Now, we can illustrate this on another slide and here it is. Along the bottom axis I've plotted the strength of the feedback factor in the Earth's system behavior. And referring back to our runaway car parable, that is, is the accelerator. The strength of the accelerator system. The critical threshold of 3.3 watts per square meter, that is the damping system, the braking system. And as the accelerator power starts to approach the power of the braking system, we find that the distance travelled by the car got further and further and further. Or, in the physical system we're looking at, the closer the feedback factor of positive amplification comes to the negative damping factor of the braking system, the higher the equilibrium temperature of the output in the Earth system. But there are factors which will push the strength of feedback up to and beyond that critical threshold into the area of runaway behaviour, where the further the Earth system goes, the faster the climate changes, and the faster the climate changes, the faster the climate changes. It accelerates into a runaway solution. That's pretty devastating. If I just go back momentarily to the previous slide, you'll see that instead of having a, a, a climate output, outcome if you like, that reaches a new stable equilibrium, we move into a period in which non-linear change, runaway behaviour, is a possibility. And if that has been triggered, then the interventions we have to make now to stop that happening are much more intensive and much sharper in terms of the time frame we have than they would otherwise be. So this is one of the most important questions to ask. And the output of the Apollo Gaia research mm -hmm. on this issue is fundamental to the strategy that we use to address the problem of climate change. Thank you very much.